How to post to a Moodle discussion forum. As an online student, you will find that most instructors use discussion boards or forums as a primary means of communication. For example, the instructor can use a news or announcement forum for sending important messages to the class. There are also social forums, places where students can talk amongst themselves, and class-related topic forums, which may also be a graded assignment. Forums can be used in a variety of ways. It will be up to the instructor to determine which type to use. Let's take a look at how to post to a discussion forum in Moodle. The first forum is the Welcome Forum. This is a general forum where anyone can post topics and responses. You can choose to be subscribed to this forum or not. Refer to the links in the upper left corner of this page. Now, what do you need to do? Here the instructor has neatly defined the directions. They are 1. Post a question you might have about online learning. 2. Read and respond to another student's posting. To post a new discussion thread, click on the button Add a new discussion topic. A new window appears. The instructions again appear at the top of the page. Type the subject of your post in the subject field. Next, type the body of your message. Note the editing toolbar at the top of the message box. These should look somewhat familiar to anyone who has used Microsoft Office or Microsoft Works. This is a full text editor. You can change the appearance of your text, add a picture, insert a smiley face, and even check your spelling. Always a good idea. When you're finished, scroll down. Note you have the option to have email copies of posts to the forum sent to your CPCC email account. This is the same as being subscribed. What does that mean? Click on the blue circle with a question mark and your question will most likely be answered. Note also that you can attach a file to your forum post. When everything looks good, click on the Post to Forum button. Voila! Moodle will give you 30 minutes to make changes to your post before it sends out emails to forum subscribers. The second part of this forum assignment was to read and respond to another student's posting. To reply, click on the message title. Read the posting and click the reply link in the lower left. You will see the original message at the top of the page. The subject is automatically filled in. RE is in response to. Write your response in the box below. Looks familiar? Yes. Scroll down. Again, the options to subscribe and attach a file. Click the Post to Forum button. You're done. Now, if you look at the forum post, you will see your reply added to the replies count. Mary has two responses. Well, this is a brief overview of how to post and reply to a forum topic. A lot of information can be shared in discussion forums. You'll have the opportunity to learn from and share with your classmates. If you have any questions about proper conduct online, check out the Netiquette Guide under the Student Resources box on the Moodle main page. Remember, contact your instructor if you have content questions or call the ITS Help Desk at 704-330-5000 for technical help. Thanks for watching.